When most developers hear the term CRUD app, the reaction is often underwhelming, maybe even a little dismissive. It's just a basic CRUD app, right? Nothing special. But what if I told you that Facebook, Netflix, and LinkedIn, three of the most advanced tech platforms in the world, are at their core just CRUD apps? That's right. These platforms are built around the simple principles of create, read, update, delete. And it's time we stop looking down on that. For beginners, CRUD apps are often the first milestone. A to-do list, a blog, maybe a simple notes app. They feel basic and unambitious. And once you've built one, you're told to move to something real. But CRUD isn't a limitation. It's more like the foundation. Facebook lets users create posts, read feeds, update profiles, and delete comments. Netflix enables you to browse, save, rate, and remove content. LinkedIn handles connections, job posts, profile edits, and more, which are all CRUD operations. The core use cases of even the most sophisticated platforms are just CRUD, wrapped in exceptional UX, and backed by robust infrastructure and scaled for billions. So why does CRUD feel so easy when we're learning, but so hard when we're building it for millions of people? Because it's not about the operation itself. It's about everything around it. For example, data consistency across distributed systems. So when Facebook shows you a like count, it might have come from dozens of servers, caching layers, and data centers. It must be accurate and fast, two things that are often at odds. Then there's latency and performance. So every click on Netflix, whether playing a movie or rating it, has to return almost instantly. That means optimizing databases, networks, APIs, and even the UI pipeline. Then there's offline support and sync. In mobile CRUD apps, data must be cached offline and later synchronized. Handling conflicts when two users edit the same record while offline, that's not a beginner problem. Then there's also permissions and security. Update seems simple until you need complex rules like user A can update their own posts but not others. Admins can update anything but only during business hours. Edit should be auditable and reversible. So if you think about all of these, CRUD apps at scale aren't about forms and buttons. They're more about system design and thinking. Now let's focus on the business value of CRUD. Most apps are CRUD apps. If you check any business software, internal dashboards, e-commerce platforms, they're all pretty much CRUD. The reason this matters is if you can build a polished, reliable, scalable CRUD application, you can solve real problems. And if you can do that consistently, you're already ahead of most developers in the job market and the startup world. So if you're still early in your dev journey, building CRUD apps might feel like baby steps, but let's flip that perspective. When done right, CRUD app teaches you database design, which is thinking in relationships, constraints, and normalization. It also teaches you API design, such as RESTful routes, versioning, pagination, filtering. It also includes authentication and authorization. That gives you an idea of user management, JWTs, role-based access. You also learn state management, both on the front end, for example, React, and back end as well, such as Redis or database. Then you also learn testing, which includes writing unit, integration, and end-to-end -end tests. Then there's also UI UX best practices that include smooth forms, undo actions, accessibility. And there's also performance tuning, where you learn how to index your DB, cache your responses, or lazy loading. Now, every one of this is a real-world skill that scales far beyond your side project. So here's what separates good CRUD developers from great ones. They basically don't reinvent the wheel, they make the wheel spin faster. They care about quality, little details from error messages to loading spinners are signs of craftsmanship. And they treat their problems seriously. Even if the app is simple, they know the execution matters. So the next time you see a dev dismiss a project as just CRUD, remember that CRUD at scale is hard, CRUD done well is also very rare, and CRUD built right is pretty much a career. So the most successful software in the world isn't always the groundbreaking one, it's the most reliable, usable, and trusted one. And that trust is built on thousands of invisible CRUD operations happening every second. So don't look down on CRUD. Master it, polish it, and push it to the edge. Because in the end, if you can make something that people use and love, whether it's a note-taking app, a food delivery platform, or a social network, you have already cracked the code. And that's not just CRUD, that's engineering.